There we go. Come on. Hi, Sandra from Scraps Beauty. It is Sunday afternoon. Had a few, well, a little bit of problem getting on today. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, so if you're watching the recording, I'm first going to show a little um, cup, a book, a magazine. Um, this is what we're going to play with today, the studio light. Um, Stamp set. That's the new um, June. The new uh, collection from um, Studio Light called the Artist Atelier. And I'm also going to be playing with. Um, let me get them out. Mary Lou's uh, printables. Up. Oh, got everything coming out. Hold on. All my stuff is coming out. <laughs> I thought it was organized, but you know how that is. <laughs> Hi, Christy. Joyce. Vicky. Hold on a second. Yeah. Never ends. <laughs> Never ends. You think you're you're set up, but I'm not. <laughs> but these are her um, printables I got off of her Etsy. You can see how pretty they are. I like her. Um, I like the idea of putting the girls into post stamps. So I did actually take one of my girls and put it in the post stamp. So so we're gonna play with these today. So now I have a problem with my printer. Can you guys see that? Can you see how it's got those streaks right here? Anybody else have that problem with their printer? It's actually on the roller itself. So I don't really know how to uh, get it off to click. It needs to be cleaned or something. So it's got these continuous lines on the uh, printer. Pain in the neck. <laughs> oh, for your new knee. Oh, wow. Just make sure you keep it up and elevated, and uh, you'll be all right. <laughs> um, so this, remember, we did last week. So I did finally add a couple more things. I'll show you this. So here's one of her little postage stamps. You can see that there. And then I added um, some of Jane's gold pen. See the gold? Yeah, there you go. I had the postage stamp. I'm trying to think what else. I did add this little flip on the acetate and the little dragonfly these were from um jane's um washi tapes that she has and they came out cute didn't they a newish procedure an outpatient really well i know they get you out as soon as you get out of surgery they get you out right away so so and if you like her technique these are um some of her samples you can find her on YouTube, Mary Lou um, Marshall. And she's got the class. I took her class, Modern Mixed Media. It was really cool. I liked it a lot. Um, all right. So so that's what we're going to play with. But I have a couple things to share first. So let me see before I do that. Um, and then if you're watching the recording, just fast forward as usual. Fast forward. So I wind up getting, okay, I'm gonna show you first. I wind up using, uh, watching uh, Devin, who also watched Lindsay the Fugle Crafter about these new brushes. So I didn't get a chance to play with them yet. But they're like, she's doing Sumi ink. Sorry for the crinkle. But I got them off of Amazon. But they're water, you can see, you put the water in here. So, like, if you're outside and you don't have, you know, any water. It's like a water brush, but it's with, um, oh, look at these, Patty. These I got on Amazon. Um, and they're um, calligraphy. I think they would be really good with your um, scripting that you guys do. So, you can get them on Amazon. And I, don't know, I think they're all different sizes. Let's see. Well, here's the packaging. I don't know if that'll help you at all. Um, but if you go to Lindsay's, I think it's Lindsay's, um, the one that she's painting the crocodile. She has a link there, so just go on her link, and then you can go directly to Amazon. But, yeah, aren't they cool? So, um, yeah, they're different sizes. You can see this one's a lot thicker. This one's a lot thinner. Now, I'm not playing with them today. Um, this one's a brown one. So you get uh, one, two, three, you get six. And I want to say they were like $14 maybe. I can't remember. So, but yeah, if you're uh, interested in like in Robin's class, you know, I think that would be, they would be good for Robin's um, 
classes. Oh, hold on. Uh, let's see, I'm trying to have something up. There we go. Yeah, and I don't think I, I try to skip through Lindsay's um, video. I think I saw her use them a little bit, but she didn't really use them much. And then I didn't watch the whole thing, so I don't know if she actually made a review or made a comment about them or not. I'll have to go back and watch myself. So, um, and then so I wanted to show you guys. Hi, Devin. Oh, I'm not gonna demo them today. Maybe next week I'll do it. I don't have something else I want to do today, so. Oh, thanks, Patty. Yeah. Um, but I looked a couple of videos and it looks mostly like people um, who do um, Japanese, like, you know, the fish or the shrimp. And they look like they just use it with uh, sumi ink. And then he said he yeah, he likes it because when he goes outside, he doesn't have to wor worry about water. And when you put the water in the brush, there's a, a knob on the top that you could... Um, determine how much water you want to come out. They look pretty cool, so, but I'm not playing with them today. <laughs> uh, didn't, she didn't demo them either? Yeah, okay. Oh, let me, oh, that's why. Oh, maybe that's why she didn't. Oh, okay. I didn't read that. I didn't know that, so, okay. So, you guys know that I'm, I'm a big fan of Studio Light. You know, they're from the Netherlands, and I really was, um, the place that I order my stuff for, where I get the products for, I was really disappointed they did not um, come with this line. This is our new um, artist atelier uh, line. So it's got four stamps. Let me see here. And I think this would be perfect with Stamperia's um, line that they came out with. Uh, yeah, painting the crocodile she did. Yeah, but I didn't, um, like, I just skimmed through it. I was waiting to see. I saw her in one hand, but then it looked like she went back to another brush. So I didn't get really a, a chance to watch the whole video. Um, but look how cool this stuff. I love this stamp here. So there's four stamps in this line. And this is the Studio Grunge line. And then there's this one. But I'm so disappointed. Like I said, my supplier is not getting this um, collection. But you can find it. Um, Joan, I don't know if you're interested in it. I don't know if you ever heard of Craft. I think it's called Craft Stash in the UK. You can... Um, order it on them they do a bundle they do like a bundle of the stamps bundle of the stencils and a bundle of the um dies because there's dies that matches too my dies didn't come in yet but um you like that yeah this one oh this one with the pen yeah, and it's got all the writing and all the little um you know graffiti like type and i love this one with the paint brushes and the little paint uh I think you can see it. Oh, here you go. You can see it there as a sample. There's that one. I like this one too. So, and this is a die. You see how it's got all these um, letters and and it's uh, bigger than a, like a journal, like a um, traveler's journal, which I like. Um, let's see what's on the other side. Oh, I love this one. <laughs> the little artist guy and the stencil. Yeah, you can get them um, from the, um, I'm trying to think, I, I can't remember, I think I can get the stencils, but I just can't get the stamps, but email me, I don't know, but if you can, don't want to wait, just go to the frantic, I think it's called frantic stamper, I'll try to find the link and put it in there after, um, but they sell everything, they've got the stamps, they've got the stencils, and they've got the dies. I'm just like I said, I'm just so disappointed, I think this is, what, is really a cool line, and they didn't they didn't come out. Hi, Dorothy. I love this one, too. It's, uh, same thing. I love this one. The numbers. Cool. And this one, I think this one's really nice. So, and like I said, I didn't get the dies yet. But, um, but there are. So, it was a total of 12. Four of the stamps, four of the stencils, and then four of the dies. Um, and then the last thing I have to show you is, uh, oh no, two things. <laughs> uh, I wound up getting these from, I know a lot of you guys are doing, um, junk journaling and stuff. And so I wind up seeing this from, I think her name is the Bohemian, Bohemian Crafter maybe. Um, but I love what uh, she does with, um, 
her journals. So I wound up getting these. They're nice and skinny. Let me use these today. Aren't they cool? They're almost sort of like washi tape. You know, you could put like make washi tape from it. So I wound up getting that one. Um, each one is a little bit different. These are like little guest checks. I do that there. Yeah. That. There's four different ones. Um, this one's like a map and postage. Let's see that there. Kathy, <laughs> let me know when your book comes in. I didn't, haven't got notice yet that it's shipped. Kathy and I both ordered the new fairy um, book. <laughs> I want to see some fairies. These are from AliExpress. I got them. And I love this one with the postage stamps. Are they cool? So I'm going to use, I think I'm going to use this one today, this long one. It's cute. It came with this little book, too. It's got, like, grid and lines. It's really cute. And they weren't that expensive. I can't remember. A couple dollars. I don't remember. But anyway, so we're going to use that. And then the last thing I have to show is, uh, I know a lot of you do collage and cut out, um, for magazines, I don't have a lot of magazines, so every time I try to go to um, like Barnes and Noble and look for a magazine to cut out, and I buy one, and I get like two little images out of it, and I spend like ten dollars on the book, and and I don't find anything. <laughs> but this is a new magazine that I um, found called Basic, and it's I think it's out of the UK. I'm not sure, but I have to be careful because there are um, I should have made a marker. There are some, you know. Nudie. I love this. Can you look? I don't want to make a postage stamp out of that. Can you see the girls' faces and um, the girls in each face? Look at that. cute. There you go. Oh, thanks, Patty. Yeah. Um, yeah, so you can find those. Um, I have to. This one is a lot. Has has some really cool images. I really like the black and white. Um, I just want to be careful because there is some. Um, First, oh, these are kind of weird. If you're into like aliens and stuff like that, <laughs> those are weird. Um, but I don't know, the one I really, I love that little pose there. But uh, let me see what I, oh, here we go. This is what, look at how cool this is. What I want to do is copy these and then shrink them down and then put them in bottles, you know, in like, um, like a message in a bottle. So there's like, you can see that there. There's four uh, different mermaids. There's that one. This one's like Ariel. Let's see that one. That one. <laughs> They're cool images. They are, yeah. And there's one more. Then there's this one. It's a totally, um, I've never heard of this book before. Let me see. I was just make sure there is no. But the beginning is a lot of um, circus theme type things. <laughs> Hey, there's a girl in the orange looks just like her. <laughs> but um, I think the images are really cool in this book. Like I said, I have a hard time finding really cool images, and I think this is like one of them. And I love the way they did her hair. Can you see how they did her hair so it looks like a hat? Pretty cool. Hey, CB, got your happy mail. Thank you very much. I love the envelope because she made a uh, face on... Uh, yeah, so it's a lot of circus theme in the beginning. But it's just totally different than some of... See, look, I love that. How they did their hair out of a hat. <laughs> Funny, isn't it? Um, yeah. And I, I want to say it was like... It wasn't too expensive. I think I, I think you can find it on Amazon. And you... Um, hey, Sharon. You can... Uh, I think it was like $15. I'm not sure. Something like that. Which I don't think is bad because the other ones I buy are like $10 and I get like two little images. But this one, so yeah, mostly circus in the beginning. Uh, but I just want to show you the different, sorry for the glare. Um, it's just totally different type of magazine than I've ever seen before. And so uh, I thought I would just share some of the images in here. Cool. I just want to, oh, there we go. I don't want that. They even have the guys in here, too. 
here's another one. This one reminds me of a, a mermaid. The glare. So, yeah. So, um, I don't know if that's monthly comes out. But anyway, this one was a good one. So, this one was... Uh, yeah, in the UK, it's $9.99. Here, it's $15.99. Um, and this one is... Which issue? Issue 15. So, in case you're looking to get this particular issue... It's issue 15. I think in the beginning it showed some other issues that were coming out. Here, here. So here's the one that I got, the 15, issue 15, and then there's a couple of others there. So this is in case you're interested in a new magazine. There you go. All right. Uh, anything else I should think that's it? Oh, I did get the, uh, more of these brushes. If somebody was looking for the brushes, I'll put them in the store later tonight. But uh, the big two-inch are back in stock. And those of you looking for the rose gold, I met a whole new batch. So they should be ready by Friday. A couple of people emailed me and asked me about uh, full pans. So I did make a couple full pans. So if you want the full pans, just, uh, just email me. All right. So let's see. Ready? Oh, and there's also washi tape that matches that line, Studio Light. So you can see they've got the, this type of washi tape. It's all white and black. I really like this one. I want to use this one. Artist Love, Create Love. I think this is the one we're going to use. Let's go with the artist. So, let me get this stuff out. I did. Oh, I have to give you guys an update too. If you remember last week, I said that I had the hives and the rash. I wound up having to go Monday um, to emergency appointment. I wound up getting like a severe reaction. Like I had the hives. My tongue was swollen. I couldn't breathe. I had like shortness of breath, even a little bit now. Still have a little bit. And I wound up giving me a shot back on prednisone. <sighs> it's always a mess. So thank goodness. I think it's maybe two more days and it should be gone but yeah that's been a rough week so i didn't really do much arting all week really um so these are the cutoffs i'm thinking we're going to do something with these cutoffs so i'm going to use these pages this is another studio light i know it's bad stuff it is it is cd <laughs> so let's see so here's one of her stamps. I thought we would maybe use that. And I cut some of them. I made some up. Well, Jimmy made them for me. Remember this one that I did? Um, I uh, sewed her on the front cover. So I actually made her a little postage stamps inspired by Mary Lou. All right. So let's see. What else do I need? Um, I have to just get it because everything fell on the floor, so hold on. There we go. So I thought we would do her. I've got that. Hello, Marianne. Yeah, me too, John. It's like terrible. It was really terrible. <laughs> So itching is the worst. And then of course it's always worse at, at night, you know. So I've got this. This. I'm looking for my other, other things I pulled out. This. There you can see I was trying to get it um, bigger and bigger. Patty, how is your printer? Can you, like, shrink it down? Like, if I wanted to keep making these postage stamps, does your printer do that? I have the laser one, but, I don't know, I had such a problem with it. <laughs> All right, So I'm actually going to use, let's see, I have all my stuff out here. Oh, this was a die that I used to cut the ticket. So this is a grunge die. You know, the slim dies are like really in now. So yeah, really cute. 
and they come with a lot of different pieces so these i can get in the store so if you guys are interested in those just let me know you can change sizes but you don't do it much oh you can yeah i don't know I was, I, every time i'm like um Oh, and I thought I was going to stitch some, but I do have a head stamp, so I'll probably stitch. So this was the book I was going to do all my um, studio like grunge from because I can pull the pages out. I want to do the cover. So let's just pull the pages out to do that. Yeah, I make pictures smaller. That's what I want to do. Brian, oh, he does it for you. <laughs> All right, so I have Jane's watercolors here. We're going to use. Uh, we might use that. This. I uh, got some of this gold out. So I had a really tiny, tiny little stamp, and <laughs> I don't even know where it is now. It's so tiny. Hopefully, it'll pop up. <laughs> Uh, we'll just get these off the floor. Oh, there we go. So these are her 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 little posted stamps. So we're gonna use probably one of those. Get rid of that. Alrighty, so actually have where's my little guy? Let's see. It goes to the side. Here he is. And then these are the cutoff from the top here. I thought I could sandwich this in. I would like to do make it like a I don't know something with a like a little tablet or something. We'll see what happens with that. Um, what happened to my little tiny, tiny one? Oh, well. Hopefully it'll turn up. Oh, there it is. Right there. Can you see it? <laughs> it's super tiny. Look at that. It's so tiny. <laughs> Cute. I'm going to leave that there so I don't lose that. All right. So. I thought what I would do is I want I was going to try to stitch this, but um, maybe I'll do it later. So I can't decide whether I should put this on the inside. I might put something else on the outside. Let's do the inside. So I can actually use this as a flip like this. Like that I'm going to glue that down. And then I didn't know if I wanted to do two of them. There's the artist. That's the artist one. Oh, you know, I didn't cut another one of these. Hmm. Well, we'll see what we're going to do. But I do know I want him on here. Isn't he cute? So cute. I might color him, too, and get some of those words off of him a little bit. I don't really, hmm. I'm trying to think. I think I want her on the inside. Or maybe I'll do her, since it's supposed to be me, the artist, <laughs> on the outside. So let's see. Because this is going to be the first pages in my book. So let's see what we can do. I meant I didn't cut one of those, another one of those. Just trying to see if I got some room. How are you guys holding out this week? Anything going on? I want to uh, also include, where is my stamp? So I made a bigger one. because This is me, of course. <laughs> my art. Um, maybe I should bring it down one. Let me see. Let me get my camera here so I see if I can get you guys down one. Um, There we go. It's as close as I can get you. 
Let me see if I can move it over. Oh yeah. <laughs> Just read the chat. Oh, I missed it. What? Well, I'm being real. Print. <laughs> For gifts. All right. So, so I think I want to do. Um, I don't want to lose my little post-it stamp. I thought I had a piece of black paper. I might, yes. I might use these postage notes. Let's see if I can just. I might just put her on here. Oh, if I have a bigger piece of paper. So I think I will. I think I'll put her on the front cover. And then I think on the inside, I'll put this guy and put the paint brushes and all of that on. Um, so let's see. Mm -hmm. Paper. <clears throat> I'm seeing if I have another one of my girls, but a little bit smaller. Oh, I don't think I do. All right. Hi, Mary Lou. <laughs> all our all our feeds are coming up for Maryland. Um, all the pictures and stuff that we've had uh, on our trip. Let me cut this down. Of course, I don't have my cutter either, do I? I have this one. <laughs> Every time I go on the ferry, which I haven't been on the ferry, this is over a year, two years maybe. Um, I think of Paul and Joan. What do they do on the ferry? They've shortened the ferry now down to only like a couple of trips. Um, it's super hard if you want to go into the city now and, um, and then try to find the right time to come back. So. <laughs> All right. So I think I'm going to do this. And I want to put one of her little postage girls on my thing, too. I don't know what color I want to go with. If I'm going to stay with just the beige and black. I kind of like this girl, too. If we brought in a little pink, if I brought her in. Or... The blue. Maybe this one. We'll go with this one. We'll put some butterflies and stuff. Paul's well, misbehaving. Uh-oh. <laughs> what what's going on? You love that trip? We do too. Yeah. It was so much fun. I was like almost wanting to go in back into the city myself. <laughs> All right. So I want to ink this. Do I have a little a brush? Oh, 
it was fun. I um, like looking back when they do all the feeds and stuff on Facebook. It's cool. It was a fun trip. And then going to Kramer <laughs> was so fun. And then CC and I, we um, stayed behind and we send them off <laughs> to the taxi. And then they wind up getting to the wrong place. <laughs> I left them alone for like one time <laughs> and they got lost. <laughs> All right, so I think, let me see if I have a little piece of lace. We'll put some lace underneath here. So I'm going to make a little dangle. I've had these from when I had jewelry, and um, I haven't used this in a while. So I, mean, I thought maybe, I've seen a couple people make some little dangles with these, so it's easy to get lost. It is easy to get lost there. <laughs> Open it. So I want to take one of these and do, let's do this. Um, how big is that? So I should use one of these big ones. So these are like little clasps. So I want to do this and then actually clasp it on. And then actually, maybe I'll do it to the side. Because I want to put a little dangle on the side for jewelry. I mean, like a little charm. You went to the cottage. Oh, how nice. That's nice, Joan. Yeah, we sold our cottage in... Um, Canada. I used to tell you guys that I had a, a little cottage in Canada. And we have to do this something with the back. Oh, I want some lace. Mm -hmm. we'll do a big piece of lace. Hold on, we'll do some lace. Yeah, we did because um, with all the stuff going on and you really can't go to Canada, you can't come here. And um, yeah, so we did. We wound up, we were thinking about it, but it, we did it a lot sooner than we would have. Um, oh, what is going on? Mm -hmm. It was in uh, Yarmouth, um, near uh, East Jador. It was in East Jador, uh, near Halifax. Uh, it was like 40 minutes, 35 minutes from Halifax. Um, I painted all the cabinets with um, little raccoon critters. It was really cool. I'm sorry to see my little kitchen go. <laughs> um, but, yeah, it was nice because we would go into Halifax in 40 minutes and then, you know, see all the festivals I love the um, cow's ice cream and the beaver tails. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> it was really good. Um, yeah, and we had a little boat and uh, Jimmy and Gabby. Well, they would fish. I don't like fishing. <laughs> I would bring my sewing machine, my scrapbooking, and I'd be uh, the whole time inside scrapbooking. <laughs> it was pretty. I'm trying to think if I, I'll have to remember if I show a picture off the post it or something. Um, all right, let's do something with this background. I'm like all over the place. I don't know what I want to do. Uh, let's get the stamps. It was a fun place. We had it for about, mm, I think like 25 years or something. So the kids loves cow ice cream. I love the way that how you could see them pour it right there and make the waffle right there. Oh, so good. We have um, cow t-shirts and let's see, let's get some stencils. Yeah, I really liked it. I liked it a lot. I took a while to find them scheduled. <laughs> I think you need your passport to go anywhere now, don't you? Let's do that one. I'll do this one, maybe. We'll do that. I want to do it with some... 
What color should we use? I wish I had my gray. What's in the other room? Which one's this? It's jet black. As you can see, I'm like got stuff all over the place. This. I'm looking for some ink. If we're going to go with the blue, I wonder if I had a light blue that I can use. Not too dark. I'm looking for some light blue. Oh, I know. I have some of that uh, Nouveau Paste. Let's put some of that through here. Where are you in um, Canada, Devin? I was always planning to meet up with Jean. I always wanted to have the girls at the cabin and have Jean and Paula. And uh, I forget who else was close by there. And that we would have like a little art thing that never happened. <laughs> Jean the musical scrapper. put some on here we will do this do this put this on there. oh I need ink what am I gonna use You're in Alberta? Oh, a long way from the East Coast, yeah. I really want a light, light blue. All my inks are like all the way on the other side of the room. <laughs> uh. All right, well, let's see what I do have here in front of me. That's it. This. This. And I've got some, maybe some foil. Maybe that's what we we'll use. She loves, yeah, her water. She's into like the Olympics now. She's watching the Olympics. Every time um, something happens, she gets so excited. <laughs> oh, look how cute. I got a little number five we can put on here. I wish they would give you all these cutouts. I wonder what they do with them all. You should sell them. Look, cute little number five. We'll put that on there. All right. Um, I'm looking for, okay, I'll sponge this through here. What's this? Oh, here's some metallic blue because it has that blue on the. Um, Am I reading my mind? I just got those flakes out. <laughs> yeah, I thought maybe we'll maybe we'll put some flakes on here. I don't know. I didn't really have a plan. Didn't, as you can tell, I really didn't have a plan today. <laughs> uh, now I need a sponge. Where are those? Oh. We'll put a poor little Jane one here. I'll use this one. Star. <laughs> All right, so let's do that. We'll do some blue. Um, what did I do with stencil? Yeah, I haven't really been drawing too many faces. It's just like, I don't know if my arm and stuff hurting it's hard to um draw on stuff lately of course i can't i didn't get enough i 
So I haven't drawn faces in, gosh, I think two weeks now. <laughs> I have to do it because then I get like nervous, like, ugh. Oh, and Jane's got a new challenge for August. If you guys are um, looking for challenges, it's um, she's doing all happy af affirmations. Um, so it's shine bright. I think it's shine bright. So she should be doing that tonight on uh, Facebook. You guys want to check her out? I want to do a whole page and then um, do some of the prompts. Oh, it didn't really work too well. I really need a spot like regular, regular ink. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, here, what's this one? Well, I've got this turquoise color. I love this. You'll be amazed. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, the Frantic Stamper. Yeah, I, this is from this collection, and I can't, I just said, I don't, just, unless they're coming out with it later, but. That doesn't mean no good right now. <laughs> All right. I think I want to. Let's put. Um, let's put some stuff on here on the back page. Yeah, they're not too badly priced either, I don't think. Maybe the bigger one. But I want an ink pad. Can you find me an ink pad? <laughs> Somewhere. Maybe I'll try my layer cakes. We'll see. Let's try layer cakes. I can't find my ink. We'll go with layer cake. How's that? Yeah, it's not too bad, so. Um, all right, so I'm going to wet this a little bit. Oh, of course, I don't have a sprayer either. Bring my sprayer from last time. Oh, I got patties. There we go. All right, so I want to do, I think I'm going to use this teal teal and blue color of course I have to put the Z in here you know that <laughs> and the seven Ooh, there we go. That's pretty. That. Put some of these little alphabets in here. Where is there a Z? Any Z? Oh, yeah, there's a little Z right there. <laughs> no, yes, there is, but I wanted a colored one. <laughs> Like a blue because the stamp here, this one that I'm going to put on there has got that little blue in it. So I wanted something blue. <laughs> but this is working great. All right, so here we got two little Z's right here. And I'll do one more up here. Yeah, I wanted color, yes. <laughs> that works out good. Blue, and then let's do a little... These are working great. Um, let me see. Maybe I use... Um, I want like a beige. So let's do this. 
and I'm going to put a little bit of this is probably driving some of you crazy and this is how I work really how I work with stuff just on top of each other <laughs> so if it drives you bananas I'm sorry <laughs> that's what I do I just pile it on I try to get a little bit organized for you guys but yeah that's just not happening today <laughs> It would help if I did have moved some of this stuff out of my way. <laughs> so I had some more room. where the doily's going mostly so <clears throat> all right so we have our little this oh to ink this it's a little brown uh, do I want black mm, brown I think what did I just do with the sponge if I threw it over there <laughs> Yeah, and then the uh, studio light you should be seeing pretty soon. Um, Art by Arlene's coming out with the new collection. Uh, she's got her um, Christmas one. I think she posted that on her feed already. That looks like a good one because it's just not Christmas. It's also um, got stuff that you could use all throughout the year. Oops, wrong one. And then she's got a new... Um, a new really cute collection. I can't even believe she's got like mermaids <laughs> with the way she has them. <laughs> it's cool. A lot of people. Um, Tim. Oh, I won. Um, um, since I go to uh, Notions, I was lucky enough to take a um, class from Tim, and he showed all the new winner. Um, dies and stuff which, um i got to see and then in the um at the end of the um zoom class they actually picked a uh, winner and i won his uh winner his winner um collection so i'll show that when i get it so that was exciting i, I think i win the whole thing the whole winner collection which is cool He's got some cute little things in there for Christmas. Yeah, that was a good one, Joan. I was glad they didn't give me the, because I think it was a uh, Halloween, because I don't really do Halloween that much. Um, and there was Christmas, and then there was oh those little houses. I don't I don't do those little houses of his, but so I was happy with the um, the winter one. It was cool. All right, so we've got that, we've got that. Um, put her in here. I want to paint her up too. Actually, I want to pop her up a little. I don't know if we can pop her up on. I need some pop dots. Oh, hey, Christine. <laughs> Oh, I want to put a little text behind her. I also want to stick this in here somewhere. I wonder. Too big. Can't put everything in there. <laughs> All right, I'm going to stick her down. And I can also paint her too. I think I'll, I'll probably paint her.
<laughs> no. I missed her little hair before. Oh, I took it off. Did I? Yeah, I did. Oh, there it goes. Oh, she's okay. Hello, Scrapjack. Welcome. All right, so we have that down so far. Well, let's see what these tapes say for the artist. Let's put that down there. I'll add some of this. I think I'm going to coffee dye the background. What do you think? All right. So this one is. So remember, they have these wash. If you're going to the frantic uh, stamper, they've got these washi tapes too to match the collection. So this one says artist artillery. Is full of magic. Oh, I'll be gonna put that one in here somewhere. Let's put her down here. Oh, let me um, let me stay in the back first. Jerry Dolly here. Hi, Rita. Welcome. So let's stay. I have some coffee spray. What did I do with it now? Right there. So let's do that. We're gonna make this a little bit wet. I'm going to spray this. And then uh, my coffee. Jimmy's coffee. I don't drink coffee. I don't like coffee. All right. That's cool. <laughs> Rita, All right? He can. There you go. You love coffee? <laughs> I don't like coffee. I'm more of a tea drinker myself. Um, all right, there we go. That's cute. What do I have on her eye? All right, so we have that. We should put some coffee stains on here. Do I have any brown ink? That would be nice. <laughs> You love green tea too? Yeah, I like green tea. Although my favorite is, um, if you guys ever heard of Tastefully Simple, I love their chai tea. Oh my gosh, so good. All right, so let's put some of these on here. Oh, they're separate, cool. All Gonna use I'll use James. This one is suntan. Hopefully that's like brownish. I was just cleaning off your desk. <laughs> oh, thanks. It just popped in now. Wow, we've been on for like an hour. Perfect, perfect color. And let's 
Let's do this big one. I've been trying so hard to organize. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's hard. All right, I'm going to. Because that's going to be under, but I want something light. Oh, that was too light. I can do that again. As I can see. Okay, so we got that. There we go. Then the video on the next one. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> That's good. <clears throat> yeah, usually I do a lot of um, art drawing, some of the Cinnabar stuff. I like to do uh, mixed media. One of my favorite things. I can print this letter. Do I want this? Blue off bits? Let's try it. <clears throat> What I'm going to do is I'm going to just tap some of this on there. There we go. Hi, Barb. <laughs> all right. Now we have that all done a little bit. So we can put our tape. Let me stick that over there. Now we can put this down. Artist Magic. That's nice and see through. Can you see that? Goes right through. It looks cool. So, all right. Now, I really think I want something a little, I don't know, I might want something a little bit smaller. I wish I had her smaller. She's in the other room, though. All right, let's do, uh, where's my little, my postage stamp? Very loose postage stamp. Do you see what I did with it? I need the to top for my glue. Right in front of me. Now, what did I do with her stamp? Anyone? Do you see it on there? <laughs> I want the blue one. This is the green, the pink. There it is. There it is. <laughs> All right, so I want a piece of lace. Let's see what I'll add. Oh, I have this thing too. I love how the background turned. Oh, thanks, Joan. Yeah, it looks cool. Put the coffee stain. I'll have to sprinkle some coffee on there too. I want to actually put some rose gold on here too. So I think this is a little too fancy. Let's try. A piece of this. So I actually want to make like a little, a little, I wanted it for the end so that I could do a, um, a little charm, but maybe I'll just do the charm at the top. All right, so let's take this sticky note. Use this paper here. Is that big enough? 
Oh no, it's not thick enough. New paper. Let's try this. This was the cutoff. I might be able to do this because I could poke a hole in this part if I. Um, where's my little thing? Oh, I can't figure out what I want. <laughs> Melting. It's so like humid here today. It's like awful. Awful. So I might put this one on here. But I want to put her on a little slight little back. Just a tiny little sliver. Good enough. Maybe I'll do it on that cutter. Let's glue her on. Any of you guys use your um, Tim Holtz uh, cutter? I think this is the first time I'm actually using it. <laughs> oh, I think I wish he would have done a little bit more jaggedy, you know? Because re really at the top, there's hardly any. Put this little piece of lace here. And there, like that. Make that way. Oh, I wish I would have put her down more. Let's get that little clip. See, I really want to put it on the side so I can get this to dangle. I think that's what I'm going to do. So that I can put, maybe I can put her. Oh, I need her to move. <laughs> move her head. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't want the charm in the middle of the thing. Oh, let's see. Let me make this smaller. Maybe what I'll do is maybe I'll put her down here. And maybe I'll do my little postage stamp up here. How's that? So that'll be my my little girl. Can you see that? Maybe I'll stick her. That's what I'll do. Just switch it, switch it around. So I'm gonna put her down there. We'll have to put something else with her. I'm gonna make my little postage stamp here. So we need more black. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna use this. I'll just use this postage note. Oh, I want brown, really. Where's the brown? Plop doesn't have to be on our head. <laughs> Too much. Let's 
let's glue her here. And I have my little scissors here that make it look like a real postage stamp. I hope I can move her over then. Remember these? I used to have a whole bunch of these scissors. <laughs> now I only have a few decorative scissors. All right, so she's going to go here. Now we need a piece of lace. Let's put a different piece of lace. Maybe I'll put her with this one, that fancy one down there. And we'll use this one. I'm going to cut this and make it like a little fishtail banner. Oh, it should be cute. And then, I don't think I want this big one now. I think I want a smaller one. Look for a little charm like a I don't know, mermaid's tail or something <laughs> to put on the end here. So I'm going to glue this on here. Glue this. look like a kind of like a postcard type of thing and then I'm going to put this right here at the top and then I can dangle a little a little charm from there from that end will be cute Can you see that? And I'll dangle a little, a couple little charms or something from there. Oh, I like that. All right, let's ink, let's ink this. And then I want to add some. Again, my mess is, my <laughs> desk is messy. I'm sorry, but you guys who like to clean up. <laughs> forget who I was watching and they were like, I have to clean up every time. <laughs> yeah, that's on me. And then next week, um, I'll try. Maybe we'll do the inside of this page. I don't know. I don't know what. Every time I say I'm going to do something, and then I don't wind up doing what I say I'm going to do. <laughs> we do something, but it's just not always what I say I'm going to do. <laughs> All right. Oh, this was what I was looking for. Some type of lace like this. All right, so we have that. I want to stamp something up there, I think. Maybe I like this one better. 
I'm actually going to spread it out. Yeah, I like this one. So I'm going to cut this here. Save that little. I'm watching the chat here. And I'm going to cut this up the middle just so that um, I can spread it out more. Plus, I don't want to waste these little flowers in the middle. <laughs> They'll just be hiding behind there. I can use them for something else. She's cute. I'll have to put something else up on the top there. Or maybe I'll put these that I just cut. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Top and bottom. All right. I love that lace. Oh, thanks. I just I got this um, recently, like at Joanne's, I think. Or Hobby Lobby. It was Hobby Lobby. So, this one here, this one here, and then snap her in here. She needs um, a little cardboard or something. Do I have cardboard? Uh, nope, not that. Oh, oh no. I touched the wire. I'm so bad at doing that lately. I have to remember to keep my hands away from there. Are you guys still here? I hope I didn't kick myself off. That would be terrible. You got yours at Hobby Lobby too? <laughs> We got that, and then we'll put these little, let me trim this up a little. Oh my gosh, I was at one of those live auctions that the girls have been doing. Oh my God, I just do not understand that, that live auction at all. Because <laughs> I see my name at a certain spot, and then they see it somewhere different, and then I'm like, Rushing to refresh, rushing to uh, get the bid in. Oh, my God. I find those things <laughs> frustrating. <laughs> and then you don't get what you want anyway. <laughs> oh, you're here. Good. Thank you. Oh, there. See, that worked out perfect. We put the two little... The two little pieces that we're hiding inside there. All right, I think. So we have our little blue. Isn't it kind of cute? Um, I think I'm going to put title the page somehow. I think it says artist something or other on one of these stamps. What does it say? Um, My okay now. I thought there was one that says um, artist. I have everything sprawled all over the place now. Oh, I'll have to put something up here. So we didn't wind up using this. Oh, let's see what one of these words. Maybe this says something on here. I know it's hard to be like, um, and then of course, like the, I was only at my second one artist. How about that? What about that? Maybe create, let's do the create one. Um, I forget who it was. Um, but I was trying to bid on a book and 
of course, it, you know, you don't know how many seconds they're down to like 30 seconds or whatever it is before they call it. And so she asked me a question or she said something. And I, instead of putting my bid in, I answered her and I lost the bid because I answered her. Oh, I was so aggravated. It was like, she's a sneaky one, that one. <laughs> Oh, cute. All right. So the last thing I think I want to do is I want to put some, I think we need to, I might color this lace later. Uh, what I want to do is just put a little bit of some texture paste. Do I have any around? Hopefully. Of course, I probably don't. So I think I want to go with, since this is kind of white, this stamp, I want to go in with some white texture paste. Can you tell me where it is? <laughs> Anybody? Texture paste. Blue, pink. Oh, come on. I have to have some around here somewhere. How about the leaf flakes? Oh, the gold leaf flakes. All right, maybe we'll do that. So I'm still wondering what, um, what do I do with thins. Okay, yeah, I have thins. All right, let's do that. I'm going to do that. And uh, let's see. I'm going to take some of, let's see what I have. One of my, I finally found my, <laughs> my stencils from Tim. They were like, I was like certain like forever. And finally in a draw was, hi, Colleen. <laughs> She can, she give me a list of what? As long as Lupita, there are a few others who can look out for. Oh, I know. It was like, I was so mad because she said that to me and then I answered her. And if I would have put my bid in first, I would have won the book. I'm like, oh my gosh, she knows the trick. And even somebody said, don't fall for her distractions or something like that. And I did fall for it. This is like, oh my gosh. It's like, they're. It's just too much, too much pressure. I can't do it <laughs> because here in Jersey, we don't have anything like that. You can't get like ledger paper. And I really wanted that book. It had some nautical um, things in it and um, had some, I forget, crabs or shrimps or whatever. I don't know. I really want the book. And she snuck it out from under me. Oh, yeah, I put them. I put all my um, Tim's on a ring. Because then it's just easier. I can just flip for it. I'm looking for the flower one. Where is that one? You know which one I'm talking about? Uh, not that one. I even have a couple of Jones on here. Jones' stencils are on here. Oh, I want the one that's got these, like, little flower things. Where are they? This one? I should just, yeah, this is the one. Number four. I started numbering them, and then I think I got away from that. <laughs> She's ruthless. I don't talk to her. Oh, really? That one? Yeah, that was like, oh, I was so mad. I, it, like, ruined my whole night. I, I had to get off, and then I was still thinking about it the next day. <laughs> Terrible. All right. Uh, let's see. So let's put this. It'll be the last thing we put on here. I think we it shouldn't take too long, a few minutes. I was gonna say uh, accidental timeout of an auction. That's frustrating. <laughs> I don't know. Too frustrating for me. All right, I need um, let's get some plastic. Right, I'm gonna put this on here. So this is Finn's new um, gilding uh, gilding glue. It's so hard to find. I like it's already out of stock. I've been trying to get it back in stock and can't get it. Can't get it. Her stuff is just like so hard. I have her new stencils coming uh, end of next week, I think. <clears throat> so if any of you guys are looking for her stencils, I have them coming. All right. So I'm gonna put. Let's do this. Put some up here. I should have used a smaller one. Let me get a smaller one. I have my little, this one. Okay. 
Yeah, I think I have Michelle's stuff coming. She's actually my first one that I um, actually got a, a book from. My very first book from her. Oh, I need a little bit more. Uh, a lot of it, yeah. Michelle is really nice. Yeah, I bought um, some of her papers. And I did, that was the first auction I went to was Michelle's this first time or um, this last time. So. Yeah, some of those girls, I don't know. It's like, I don't know. And then I gave some happy mail to some, um, to some of them. They never even said thanks, really. I was like, wow. I mean, if you can happy mail with somebody, I think you should say thank you. <laughs> I'm not asking you to write me a big long letter or anything or email me. Just if you see me in chat, say, hey, thanks for the happy mail. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That's me. <laughs> I don't want to cover that up, so... All right, so we have it in that place. Hopefully, one, two, three, and then I'll just put it down here in the corner. There we are. Yeah, I know, Colleen. It's, I don't know why people are like that. I was like Jane. We you watched her video last night. She said she was at the bookstore and she was getting um, affirmation books, you know, sparkle bright, you know, be happy. So the, I guess she was looking for some help or something. And so one of the, I guess, ladies came over to her and she said she wasn't helpful at all. She was like grumpy. And she's like, I'm trying to buy a nice you know, happy book, and here you are being all grumpy. <laughs> and she said, she went to the register, a different lady, a different clerk lady, and she was checking her out, and she was the same way. <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh, what is with people lately? And then she's like, here, I bought this, I should just given it to her, she said. <laughs> Maybe that would have made her happy. <laughs> Hi, Kathy. <laughs> is this the right stuff for the glue? Yes, this is her gilding. It's exactly for um, her gilding. That's her gilding glue. And it's good. I have her somewhere, but I'm using this Cosmo Cricut one because that was right there in front of me. So it's like, oh, my gosh, people. <laughs> you have to smile brighter and bigger, right? That's true, Sharon. Yep. <laughs> All right. So this is almost clear. You can see it here. It's starting. See when it gets to be clear? Like this is white. You can see it's still kind of white. So we have to wait just a little bit for this to dry. I think she said I could hit it with the heat gun. So let's try it and see what's the worst could happen. I'll just hit it a little bit. Heat gun. I don't want to dry the whole thing, though, so that's perfectly dry, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, there we go. It didn't look like texture paste. Oh, no, it's not texture paste. I couldn't find my texture paste, so Patty said do the flakes, so, ah! so we're doing the flakes. You can open it. There we go. I have to be careful because my air is on. <laughs> I'll be getting this all over the place. Let me just put that on there for now and see. I have one of her brushes. Might not be, it's probably not dry enough yet. Let's see. 
Mm. Looks are so messy, but yeah, so worth the wait. It's true. Yeah, it really was. This was nice and dry, but down here was just wet, really, still. So I'm not going to do the bottom yet. I've got to wait a little bit. Yeah, that was still kind of gummy. But see? I like this. The boy, the flower came out there. So. This one I might be able to do. Let's try that. I like this Cosmo one because it's got like everything. It's got blue and red and it's different. Patty has all those different. I love all those different ones Patty she used. She got from England. Still kind of wet, I think. I usually put them in a little box, but I just didn't have time to do that now. Plus, we were, like, deciding <laughs> deciding what to do. I've never done. Oh, you didn't? Oh, that's good. Yeah, it's better off to put them, like, in a box. Just not take them out the way I have them. <laughs> um, because then they get all over. And then I save some of the crumbs sometimes and um, reuse them. So, let's see. So, we want to pat these down. And like I said, I really should wait it a little bit longer because this really wasn't really wasn't dry. Should have taken a little bit longer. But it's good enough just for some color. Really, it's just what I want on here. Okay. And then I'll just brush this off. Let me get another brush. That looks good. Yeah, it's a little messy, but like I said, I, if I was doing it the right way so I wouldn't have a big mess, I would put this inside a box and I would do it like that. Oh, I could put more glue here. Um, but it's like when you're doing a stream, you just can't do, can't think of everything, can't do everything. Yeah, but I like the page came out cute so it came out and I'm going to color her I think I think I'm going to um, color her with um, pants Get this off in here but there so there it is I love my little postage stamp like I said I'm going to put a little dangle here so thanks um, yeah and I like the color and a little bling I'll probably sprinkle some um, gold too on here actually rose gold but yeah and then when it dries a little bit better, I'll get all the rest of the, the crumbs off. So, yeah, she looks cute. Super cute. Thanks. Thanks, everyone. All right. So, I will see you next week. I don't know what we'll do. So, we'll see. Oh, thanks, Patty. Have a good week, everyone. And then, uh, oh, what else is going on? Mm, nothing else. Like I said, uh, new stuff will be coming in next two weeks. Made junk journals by your hands on vacation. Oh, that's good. Oh, I do have some. I'm, next week, I am going to show you. A lot of you do digitals from for your junk journals. I have a Halloween one that I found from this girl. It's a digital, but it's um, more like a girly. Oh, I don't know how to explain it, but I'll show you. I'll show you those digitals next. Thanks, Patty. Thanks. Have a, I hope you're not having another rough week this week. So, everyone, take care. Thanks for hanging in there with me, and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye. <laughs> Night, June.